this video tutorial I will explain Spring 4, Hibernate 4, MySQL 8 and uh, Maven integration example and uh, we will use uh, XML configuration for this example. Here you can see employee table, it has uh, 5 columns, ID, name, joining date, salary and SSN. We will see using Spring Hibernate how to create a record in the employee table, how to update the record in the employee table, how to delete the record from the employee table and how to get the record from the employee table. Here you can see the project structure. Here you can see pom.xml. Here I have defined dependencies for Spring, Hibernate and MySQL. And one important point is we have to use the MySQL connector which is compatible with the MySQL server which is installed in your system. Here I have defined the class employee and the table it is going to store is employee table. And here I have defined the properties like ID, name, joining date, salary and SSN which are corresponding to these columns. Here you can see application.properties file in that uh, I have defined driver class name, URL of the database, username and password of the database and uh, hibernate properties. Here you can see spring configuration XML, spring container read this uh, spring configuration XML and uh, it does the component scan for this package and based on the annotation it does the auto wiring and spring container creates a data source object to create data source object spring container needs to know driver class name url of the database username and password of the database and spring container creates a session factory object and spring container creates a transaction manager object Here I have defined the class uh, abstract DAO. It has uh, get session method. This method get the current session from the session factory and uh, returns. It has uh, persist method and uh, delete method. Here I have defined the interface uh, employee DAO. It has uh, abstract methods like uh, save employee, find all employees, delete employee by SSN, find the employee by SSN and update the employee. Here I have defined the class employee DAO impl which extends abstract DAO class and implements employee DAO interface and provide implementation of these methods. And this class is the repository class. Here I have defined the interface uh, employee service. It has uh, abstract methods like uh, save employee, find all employees, delete employee by SSN, find by SSN and uh, update employee. 
here I have defined a class uh, employee service impl which implements uh, employee service interface and provide implementation of uh, these methods. This class is the service class and uh, from this service class we are calling uh, DO methods. Here I have defined a class uh, app main. Here I have created uh, application context object by reading uh, Spring Configuration XML using uh, getBean method of uh, application context object, getting uh, employee service object from uh, Spring container. Then I have created uh, employee one object. Then I have created employee 2 object. Then I am saving employee 1 object in employee table. Then I am saving employee 2 object in employee table. Then I am getting uh, all employee records from uh, employee table. Then I am deleting the employee by SSN. One employee record is uh, deleted. Then I am getting uh, employee record by SSN. Then I am updating the salary as uh, 50,000. Then I am updating the employee record. Before updating the salary, it was uh, 30,000. After updating, now it is changed to 50,000. You can get uh, Java source code link from the description of the video. In mobile, to see the description, click on uh, this icon. It will expand like this and uh, here you can see the description. It contains uh, Java source code links. Click on these links to get the Java source code.